all right this is um red dead redemption for the ps4 this is my playthrough part 43 Alrighty. i gave that um stranger all the items that he needed so i gotta wait a couple of days so in the meantime i'm gonna get the hell out of this town i want my horse there. okay let's see here we're gonna move on with the story we'll come back to this guy later when you're ready he'll pop up on the map later on so that in mind Let's see. I don't think I could take a stagecoach to here, so. Let's go on to these landing. Go, go down here. Which is a shame because it would be nice. If I could take a stagecoach all the way out there, but nope. Can't. We're going all the way back to Blackwater, so it's going to be a nice long ride. Let's go. And so far, my own videos have been doing pretty good. I'm surprised. See how Spider-Man 2 turns out. I wish people would watch the video longer. Would be nice. You know, watch it for at least 10 minutes or something. Oh dear, oh dear. Gotta wait. Gotta wait for that train. Making sure that mic's not too close to me. Whoa there, whoa there. We're gonna do that doctor mission. That's in Blackwater, so I'm gonna go out there. Over there, over there. Can I stop it? <laughs> My man went flying. Come on. See, where's the gunshot? Right here? Stay right there now. Check out this guy for a minute. Open. Darn it. I see you in there. One up your shot. Dude, what time does the shop open up? What you looking at, partner? That's cool. All right, let's get out of here then. Shop's not opened up yet. Let's go back to town. Uh, not Agent Ross. I want. So cool. Nice name. Still there to see this clown. I 
no more. Thank you so much. He didn't look like a very nice fellow. Where'd my horse go? I swear. Stay with me, horse. About disappearing, damn it. Come on. Get out of here. I wonder what I'm doing over trying not to sneeze. <laughs> uh, I swear, every time my nose acts up, I cannot control it. Move on with the story, try to get this done. Where's the gunshot bit? Gunshot. No, there's one here. There it is. Right there now. Looking for the latest in shooting irons? You came to the right place. Hello there. Yes, sir. Fred. Don't be shy. Feel free to look around. See what you got, partner. Buffalo rifle. Wonderful. Yeah. How much cash do I got? Five thousand bucks, huh? Damn. Some of that. That'll be all. Thanks. Enjoy. All righty now. Where's my darn horse at. Stop running away, damn it. I don't remember you, sir. You go see this doctor. All righty. Get this going. Oh, incredible. Simply incredible. Hello, Professor. Oh, hello, sir. Oh, Mr. Marston, sir. Good day. Good day. How are you? Well, my family's health and well-being are being threatened by some unscrupulous government agents, and my own hard-won freedom is under duress. But these problems aside, I suppose I'm fair. <laughs> yes, the problems of civilizing nomads. Uh, tell me, sir, are you from Norse stock? Not as far as I know. I was raised in an orphanage. My father was Scottish. Hmm, unfortunate. Uh, uh, you'd make an interesting case for my theory of natural population characteristics. Really? Well, yes. A, a white man, obviously, but 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 with a savage spirit. Uh, uh, trust me, sir. I mean savage in the best possible sense. Uh, natural nobility, but also simple, uh, pure. Uh, I've been looking at some blood samples through my microscope, and, and you know what? No. 
Oh, well, of course you don't. It's a remarkable breakthrough. I've been looking at the blood of both natives and white men of corresponding height, weight, and age, and you know what? Again, no. They're exactly the same. It's remarkable. It completely refutes my last book. But I'll tell you what, sir. This sabbatical in the field may have been somewhat forced upon me by circumstance, but my scholarship has benefited enormously. Would you uh, like to partake of a syringe of cocaine? I've quite enough for two. Not right this minute, no. So it's a remarkable drug. It entirely restores the ego. It takes one back to a primal state. It helps my thinking enormously. Oh, yeah, sure it does. Oh, oh Nastas, uh, uh, come on. Um, Drug addict. Come in, <laughs> sir. Would you like to take off your slippers? Or, or, or skin a rabbit? <clears throat> I know. We cannot see the stars, but still my heart is pure, and we meet <laughs> as equals. These savages must be spoken to simply in metaphors. <laughs> no, sir. I grew up on a reservation and attended school. Oh, lovely. <laughs> but I can show you what you want to see. I know where the group of bandits you seek are hiding, both of you. Vanderlyn has attracted a following of young men on the reservation. They are turning to bad things. The savage heart cannot be conventionally civilized. I was right all along. <laughs> Where's Dutch Vanderlyn based? In the hills, in Cochinay. Let's go. I know a way there that is not guarded. Uh, marvelous. <laughs> it's simply marvelous. Hello, sir. Time to do our bit for humanity, Mr. Marston. I uh, reckon so. Come. Let's hurry. Stay close. All right, Tonto. Relax. So, I understand we have a mutual interest in Mr. Vanderlyn. You gonna kill him too? Kill him? Good God, no! What is it with you people out here? Yeah. No, Vanderlyn fascinates me. A white man living among natives. A civilized mind turned savage. It's reverse integration or regressive acculturation. Uh, yeah. I don't know. I, I haven't found a name I like yet. He was never that civilized. Oh, oh, my of course. <laughs> Edgar Roth mentioned your unique history with the man. Gotta get my right gun. Oh, come on. Look, Mr. Marston, Buffalo. Oh, what a noble beast! I see him! The white man will soon be the end of them. What on earth are you talking about, Gaston? <sighs> Too much hunting, sir. Your whole society is based around hunting. We hunt to eat, not for sport. Soon, there will be no buffalo left. Who teaches you this nonsense? Extinction is a myth refuted by Darwin. Species don't die, they evolve. Hunting in time will make the buffalo stronger. seen trees before I thought you were a brave cultural explorer it's this way oh. oh. comes out of nowhere I rarely leave my room I explore with a mind Mr. Marston enjoy it while Very you still shot, can man. soon you will have cut down all of these trees me or are you making a sweeping statement about the white man in general there is no respect for the land anymore I'm sensing some hostility, Nastas. Some anger. Talk me through this primal emotion, where it's coming from. Don't worry about it, Professor. Stop hating on the white man. <laughs> you almost got killed by a deer bear. Not my favorite hunting spot. Come on. Leave the horses here and climb the rest of the way. 
Easy. Remarkable. I'm afraid I don't really have much of a head for heights. More of a, a head for highs. <laughs> well, well, anyway, I'm sure Nastas will help you. I must be on my way. I, I've got work to do. Thanks for the help. Goodbye, gentlemen. Enjoy yourselves. What's you coming Let's along get for? Moving, Mister. All right, Tato, relax. Ace, you can actually yelling at me. That's a big old zit right there. Probably shows up on the camera too. Damn it. Can't wait to pop that one. And a brace. See if you can find another route, Mr. Marston. I will have a look around. Yeah, no kidding, bro. Left me hanging, huh? Let's see what I got here. Shotgun. It's a semi-auto right here. I think I'm good. Uh, let's go this way. I gotta do it the hard way. That a skunk. It is. You know what? Let me help you out, bro. Looked like you were stuck there. go through or up the mountain All right, where's this cave at oh good this should save us some time you don't give it here bush in here oh. dynamite yourself now calm down bro just watch where you're walking this way else wait a minute, wait a minute. 
Better get chest. What can I say, partner? I'm hurt pretty bad. I don't think you should go any further. I'll be fine. But you go ahead. I don't want to slow you down. You sure you're all right? Just need to take it slow. Go on. It's only a I'll flesh wound. Or see you on the way down. Don't worry about me. Go look for Vanderlyn. Good luck. What's that? Here, bear somewhere. It's probably up top. If he is, I'm gonna get the shotgun ready for him. Come, bear. I hear you snarling. Stay right there, bro. Oh, come on. Up there, dummy. Fall down that dumb hole. Come on, bear. Come on. Doing all that snarling for, for what? You know how many of you I killed? Quick, I saw a skin on Still his ass in Mexico. Take that little big horn, too. Come on, let's get this over with. All righty, where was I going? This way. Get out there, dummy. Get out there. Let me make climb this big mountain. Just for this guy. Or Tonto, whatever's bleeding out. Sick homie's gonna make it. Got another one. Oh. Damn <laughs> God damn cougars! I was wondering what killed that. Stop attacking me! Destroyed. Oh, fuck that. I'll skin him. Well now. We're climbing. So I got shotgun ready. Get up there. Going to the tippy top. I'm pretty sure they didn't. Get up here this way. There's an eagle. Bigger eagle. I should do. Um, I destroyed him. Get up there. This old tomahawk for. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Gotta get a little closer. <laughs> Let's 
It's too bad I can't pick it up. I even got binoculars. Nice. You see me from all the way up there. <laughs> Mr. Marston? Mr. Marston? Mr. Marston? Are you back all the way here? <laughs> here you go, all Mr. Right. Marston. Put that stuff away. You banged your head. Nastas and I carried you down. Mm. Uh, well, uh, Nastas uh, heard the shots and he hurried up to rescue you and he carried you down. I improvised an escape plan. I'm more of a planner than a man of action. <laughs> Thank you, gentlemen. Friends of mine are with Vanderland. We must try to reason with them, sir. Vanderland's gang contains several natives. We must meet with them and try to save them from disaster. My people have already endured many disasters. Before, this was all our land. And now we have brought you civilization. Oh, sure, it hasn't been easy, but it hasn't been easy for anyone, Nastas. Why, I knew a man in Yale whose father once shot 18 natives in one afternoon out in Wyoming. Oh, the man was quite, quite traumatized. He took to lying with choir boys. For a wise man, you are a very stupid man. Mister, <laughs> gentlemen, stop hating. I'm going to leave you to figure out right from wrong. You are simple-minded, sir. Thus, I do not blame you for not understanding reason. Uh, then again, <laughs> careful there, doctor. Hey, you're that guy who kills people. Sorry, Mister. How are you doing? Sure. Trophy, huh? I don't mind foreigners coming to Blackwater for work, but not Mexicans. Balderdash. Very cool detail. Really must go. See their hair There's blown. Goodbye now. Goodbye. All right. That wasn't too bad. Um, what's left here? We got Agent. Let me see. Did my stranger come back yet? No, probably one more day. I think there's no other missions left, so that's cool. Um, so some right here. Let's go visit the general store. Let's go see what's in the shop. I have to play by your rules, mister. Tell me what to do. I do for you. Hi there. That Alex T. Davenport eradicator soap will strip the map. Believe you. Me. Step to it, mister. One of those horseless carriages just ran over a Chinaman. I saw it. I bet Good. you did. I got what I need. Probably didn't even help that poor Chinaman out. All right, let's could go here. I think I'll end the video. Get in here. I'm so sorry, sir. I didn't mean nothing, Mr. Mike. You look like a blackjack player. Handsome blackjack player. Yes. I hear Mr. Ray is one of the big victims down in Mexico. Grab some of this ammo. Yep, I'm gonna end the video here. Come back for another one. We'll do the agent video or um mission. <laughs> All right, let's see.